Hello everyone, it's Brandy here, and I am so excited to share with you the details of our upcoming Creative 8 Spring Retreat. It is one of the most fun times, and I get so excited, the Creative 8 team and myself, we get so excited to create projects for you and to come together as a crafting community and to share together and to fellowship. It is just an awesome, awesome day. Um, so for those of you that have joined me before, I'm super excited and hope you'll, con you'll consider joining us for the upcoming event. Now, if you haven't joined us before and you're like, okay, what is a Creativate online stamping retreat? Like, what is that? Well, I actually have some notes here. I wrote down some of the questions that I get quite frequently about the Creative 8 retreat. So I'm excited to kind of go through those and share with you what to expect and what the Creative 8 online stamping retreat is all about. Most importantly, if you like to make cards and you like to stamp and you're looking for ideas and inspiration, well, you don't want to miss it. I promise you, it is just such a fun, fun time. Okay, so some of the questions that I wrote down is uh, what kind of projects can I expect? Well, that's a really good question. So at the Creative 8 Retreat, we try to create projects, everything from 3D items, boxes, bags, uh, fun folds that we all love, and techniques, that's right. So we like to do techniques, sometimes one sheet wonders, different ways to use cardstocks and paper. So we like to kind of switch it up but we want there to be something for everybody. And so we'd like to show you different cards, right? With each technique or each fun fold so that you've got lots of ideas so that you can go to your craft wall and you can pull off your stamp set and you can create and make the cards that we're sharing with you. So it is across the board and we try to have a good variation. So there is something for everybody. Um, so that's what you can expect as far as the projects go. All right, so what do I get for $45? The event is $45, what do I get? Well, that's a good question because you get a lot of stuff. So I made some notes here. So you're gonna get um, nine YouTube live presentations. That's right, you have the opportunity to join us live for nine different presentations throughout the event. Now, let's just say you can't join us live. That's okay. You're still gonna have access to all of those videos and those tutorials that you can download and print. Speaking of tutorials, that's right, you're gonna have 36 full color PDF tutorials that you can print for your idea book and inspiration. So you're gonna have lots of ideas that you can use for weeks and months to come. Now, I've also written down there's 36 prizes. That's right, there's 36 prize giveaways. Holy moly, so there's lots of opportunity to win some Stampin' Up! goodies and prizes. And everybody who registers is put into the drawing and you don't have to be present to win. So the next thing is, is there's pre-retreat challenges. This is one of my favorites. So we like to kind of dust off our stamp pads and, you know, pull out our stamps and kind of get warmed up. And so we like to share challenges with you. And these challenges can range from everything from, you know, design challenges to color challenges to crazy challenges let, you know, that we just kind of think of. Like one of the last challenges that I um, had offered as a challenge was you have to use two embossing folders on a card. Yeah, that's right. So two different embossing folder designs. It was so fun and the ideas were and the inspiration that people posted and shared were amazing. So the challenges are fun. You don't have to participate, but it's a lot of fun if you do. And so that is also available. So there is four different challenges and they start tomorrow, April 4th, and they run every Monday before the event. Now, the good news is, is, you know, you can join any time, but if you join sooner than later, you can get in on those challenges and have a lot of fun posting and sharing those. Speaking of posting them, well, what does that mean? Well, the Creative 8 Retreat, we actually have a Creative 8 Facebook group. That group is solely for sharing. That's right. So when you make a card, you're going to take a picture. 
then you're gonna go over to that Facebook group for sharing the Creative 8 Spring 2022 Facebook group and you're gonna find the post that corresponds with the challenge or the card that you're making that, you know, the, the tutorial. And you're gonna post it in the comments and you can scroll through and see lots, sometimes like, like well into the hundreds of different projects and ideas. It is amazing. Like I love to go back and look at all of the ideas and the inspiration. And I'm just so amazed at like, oh my gosh, I would have never thought of that. So, you know, you're just getting a lot, um, a lot of good stuff there. And of course you can comment on other crafters cards and encourage one another. We, you know, encourage a positive community of sharing and, um, you know, and ideas and inspiration. All right. So you're, course that fellowship aspect of it to get to know crafters from all over that's right we have crafters from all over the world that join us so this event is open to everybody um, we have had crafters join us from Canada Germany Great Britain Australia New Zealand oh my goodness I could be missing somebody but um, you know here from the USA we have had folks join us from all over and it is so fun to uh, mingle amongst each other in the comments and so forth. So really pretty cool there. Now, one of the things that I have on my notes is that you're gonna have continued access. That's right. So if you can't join us live for the event, you will absolutely have access to all of the videos, all of the tutorials. You'll be entered into the prize drawings and all those sort of things. That's right. So you can enjoy this event at your pace as you would like to do that. You don't have to go into the comments. You don't have to share on Facebook unless you want to share. If you have Facebook, you can certainly go and look at all those beautiful ideas and find lots of inspiration there, right? So that is all available to you just by joining us for the Creative 8 Spring Retreat. So excited to have you. I've been working on my projects and I just finished, I put the final touches on my project last night and I love it. So excited. I filmed my backup video. That's right, in the event that YouTube just crashes, which it's not going to do that because we do everything on YouTube live, right? But in the event there's a technology issue or you can't get on YouTube or whatever happens, all of our tutorials have backup videos. That's right, so you can watch the backup videos if you choose to do so. Um, so that is all available to you. Now when you register, um, each Creative 8 leader has their own registration link. That's right, so we don't share registrations. So if you would consider registering with me, I'd be so grateful for that. Um, you would go to brandyscards.com and in the navigational bar, you'll click on Creative 8 Retreat. And all of the details are there. You can see all of the details. And of course, if you have any questions, feel free to reach out and send me an email. I'd love to answer those for you and um, you know, answer any questions, help you along the way. And you know, one question that just came to mind, you don't have to have the exact supplies that we're using. So I think I mentioned that earlier. Our goal is that you can use any color cardstock, any ink, you can use any designer series paper, any stamp set that you have, and that you can recreate these projects. That's right. So um, that's pretty cool. It is a lot of fun. It's a super fun day for sure. So I'm gonna look down here and I think that I have covered most of my questions. So I just love the Creative Aid event. Um, I do have a few projects here that we have shared in the past, um, you know, a couple of my favorites. And so I thought that I would show them to you really quickly so you could kind of get an idea of, you know, what some of the projects might be. Now again, these projects that I'm gonna show you, they're from past retreats. So if you like these projects, these projects are not gonna be in the spring retreat. There's new ones, we're gonna surprise you. So I'm not gonna show them to you, no, no, no. However, if you really like these, we do have the tutorials available to you on Brandy's card. So you can actually purchase past retreats and get the downloads and the tutorials and the videos and all that good stuff as well. So if you really like these, they are available to you too. So here, let me bring these over and show these to you. 
This one is so cute. I love this. And so this stamp set, when you open it up, you can see it pulls out and then you have your fun little koalas. So this piece is actually die cut from the front and then it's turned and then you can see the fun scallops. Super cute, love, love, love this one. I've got your back. Then the other, one of these other techniques that I shared once was the chalkboard technique. I love this card and you can kind of see um, the fun background that I did here, the coordinating envelope and um, on the inside, a day without coffee, cookies and chocolate. Hmm, just kidding, I have no idea. That's pretty much true around here. So that's one of those, and here's a fun one. Um, so this one was pretty cool. Have you ever done this technique? Oh yeah. Okay, so this one, if you like doing puzzles, you're all in. If you're not a puzzle doer, well, maybe you won't love this one as much, but I absolutely loved it. And it's, um, it's a lot easier to do than it looks, but it was a really fun, neat, fun technique to, to learn and also to share at one of the retreats. Okay, so I have another fun fold here to share with you. I love this stamp set. And um, this is not good. Yeah, that probably doesn't feel so good having your knot in a neck, right? Um, but when you open it up, you can see that this was just kind of a fun, fun fold. Hope things get better soon. And um, it's got a little belly band and it goes right back over the card. So those are just a few of the, um, you know, we've been doing, we've been doing these retreats now for, gosh, I think this is like the eighth one, maybe the ninth one. I've lost track, honestly, um, but we've been doing them for quite a while. So if you go back to Brandy's Cards and you want to look at some of those tutorials, we do have a graphic showing kind of sneak peeks of um, some of the projects that you get in there. Um, but I've got lots of fun projects that we've done. It is just a really neat day. And you know what? Shame on me. I haven't even shared the dates. Oh, <laughs> okay. So save the date. It's April 29th. So we're going to do a couple hours in the evening on April 29th. And then we'll go um, most of the day on Saturday, Saturday, April 30th. That's right, and the schedule will be posted. You can see all of those details on brandyscards.com, and the registration link is open, so you are welcome to go there and get registered right away. And then, of course, once you do that, you're gonna be directed to a main event page. It's the Brandy's Cards main event page, and when you get there, all of the details are there. You're gonna have the link to your Facebook group, right? That you can click on and request to join. And you're also gonna have all of the links to the YouTube Lives. Nothing's gonna work yet. That's right, nothing's gonna work yet. But it will right before the event. So, um, and you're gonna be able to see who was a prize winner in case you weren't available to join us. So lots of good stuff going on here. Um, and it's gonna be a super fun day. I hope that you will consider joining us. Um, I would love to share with you and love to craft with you um, all weekend long. So I look forward to our next Creative 8 Spring Retreat. If you've joined us in the past, I'd love for you to comment and share your experience. I find that um, hearing the experiences from other crafters is pretty amazing. I think we all attend the retreats for different reasons. So super fun. All right. Thank you so much for considering uh, joining us and registering with me. And I look forward to seeing you towards the end of the month. Take care. Bye, everybody.